Alright everyone, we have a lot to do today, so let's just get to it. Mordecai and Rigby, I need you to get rid of the groomer who keeps flooding the toilet at the cupcake stand. Ugh. I'm sorry, do you two have a problem doing your job? Come on dude, you always make us deal with the YouTube pedophile infestations. Why can't you get someone else to demonetize them? Mordecai and Rigby, if you don't get Eat That Pussy 445 out of the park by the end of the day... You're fired! Ugh, fine Benson, but if he starts ranting about the dolphins, I'm shooting him on sight. You know who else likes to groom children on the internet? My mom! Bruh. I, uh, I don't really have a relationship with her anymore after her predatory behavior. Damn, muscle man, your mom is a monster. Alright, dude, what's the plan? Oh, it's simple. I'll go undercover as a miner online with a fake kick account and add him. Then I will slowly get his trust through the course of flirting and receiving slash masturbating to his dick pics. To get into character, of course. Then we will ambush him on camera and ask him questions till he runs away and we call the police on him. No, dude. That's gay. Do you have a better idea? Yes. Yes, I do. Think about it. What do YouTube pedophiles love more than anything? Toy unboxing videos! No dude, validation from people too vulnerable to see how pathetic they are. We just gotta inflate his ego until he inevitably tries to sexually assault us. Then we have a patriarchic right to shoot him in the face. Aw, yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Yo, what the fuck is up, everybody? It's your boy, Eat That Pussy 445 and me, Jared, and Drake about to get the fuck up out of here, man. We just flooded the bathroom at Subway, and we need to get the fuck out of here, you feel me? You should seriously consider losing some weight to Eat That Pussy 445. Being healthy is a choice, and with Subway footlongs only being $5, that's right, $5, you could trim that disgusting, greasy fucking pig fat and wear jeans half a size smaller. Jared, I don't give a flying fuck, pussy. We gotta get the fuck Shut up out of here, up. man. Ooh, a cupcake? Don't mind if I do? Alright, there he is, bro. No way, is he with BBL Drizzy and... Is is that Tom Hanks? Dude, maybe EDP is kinda cool. Ow! Mm-mm-mm. Mm. Ain't nothing I like more than skeening on some pedophile cheeks. Excuse me, gentlemen. I'm here with my camera crew looking for an online pedophile. Oh, what are you, SVU? Are you here about the park rumor? Yes, I am. Oh yeah! The cops are gonna take care of it for us, dude! Law enforcement finally did something right! And even better, that means no work for us today! <laughs> <laughs> so, are you two gonna help me find the pedo, or...? Oh yeah, totally, dude. Well, great. Have you two seen a Pops Mailerd around here? Uh, yeah? What does that have to do with the pedophile, man? He's fucking getting away. Well, according to this chat log, Pops is the park pedophile. The things Pops Yakuchi then Splugi 345 was typing was downright despicable. And it really makes you wonder. Can we get much higher? The stuff this Skeet Hansen is doing is downright despicable. You have this guy who confronts online predators and he just does it for the fame and money. And it's honestly disgusting. And it, it really makes you wonder. Can we pretend that- Fact. Drizzy Drake had the superior diss tracks in the Kendrick Lamar beef. Pickle Rick Lamar can't handle the OVO smoke, and instead resorted to making up a bunch of slander and lies about Aubrey. And everyone wants to ride Kendrick's nuts because he raps about transphobia and racism. It's not Drake's fault that anyone who is white and those who know that there are only two genders are morally and intellectually superior. For a man of God, he sure loves catering to the leftist crybabies. And it just really makes me wonder. Can we get it how we used to get it like when Top had the red charger? Oh, dude, skips. Skips! Skips! Let me guess. Skeet Hansen is here to expose Pops for being an online groomer? I'm asking you right now, are you, am I going to jail for what this is or not? Well, Christopher, uh, did, did you have this conversation? No, I did not have this conversation. But if I'm, am I f being accused of it and you guys have 
quote unquote evidence, then take me to fing jail. Is it your okay. Phone number or is it not? That is my phone number, yes. Is your phone and number. You in the, you're wearing the same hat. And yes, that's yeah. that's my profile pic that I've had months ago, six months ago. Okay. Yeah, that's what I just I just wanted to verify that. And I just wanted to ask, you know, Christopher, why I mean why partake in a conversation like this? With a I did not t partake in that conversation. You didn't. No. But how do we explain can, it coming from your phone number, Christopher? But can like can't people on dating like sites like can't they use someone They're talking about my still like can the phone they number. put the phone number in and it still go I'm to I'm pretty him? sure they can no. clone phone numbers or SIM cards or something. I don't know, but they'd have to physically have the phone. But, I don't know. You see, that's but, how it's, it's perfect because I work in IT. But Christopher, awesome. what, what reason would someone have to use your phone number and do this sort of thing? I don't know. I have ex-girlfriends that hate me. The one girl, I told her I had cancer and she okay. didn't give a f She's just like, oh, you know what? Go ahead and go ahead and die.